Chronic wasting disease is a fatal brain disease of deer, moose, and elk. Even though CWD has a low prevalence in North Dakota, the Game and Fish Department wants deer hunters in the 2024 surveillance units to get their deer tested. We'll have collection sites, you know, set up during the rifle season up in the northeast, um, and again in 3B2 unit, and uh, yeah, so it'll just give the opportunity to hunters to drop off their, their, uh, their deer heads at those collection sites. Hunters inside or outside the surveillance units can get their deer tested by requesting a self-sampling kit at gf.nd.gov or by dropping off their deer heads at a Game and Fish Department district office or deer head collection sites in the surveillance units. Once a hunter submits uh, a sample, we get back to the lab, we'll uh, sample that deer and uh, get that sample off to the diagnostic lab for testing. And, uh, and from there, you know, uh, roughly a hunter can expect about four weeks to get those results back. Um, and those results will show up uh, underneath their hunting or their account on our Game and Fish website. And it'll show up as an inbox message. The Game and Fish Department each deer season samples a quarter of the state as part of surveillance efforts. Our prevalence uh, right now with CWD is relatively low in North Dakota. Uh, we do not want to, to see it spike up, you know, and that's why we're, we're conducting these management practices and doing our surveillance every year. Um, so just to kind of get an idea of uh, the prevalence in the state and uh, how to best manage to keep that prevalence somewhat low. It's important for hunters to participate in the CWD surveillance efforts every year. Hunters can help, you know, by getting their deer tested and, uh, and hopefully we can, you know, keep healthy deer herds on our landscape for future generations. This is Mike Anderson in the North Dakota Outdoors.